Hi everyone, welcome to the Space Claim tutorial by Scutio. Today we are going to see how to repair an STL file from a 3D scanner for 3D printing. To have a complete overview on using Space Claim for 3D printing, please check out the previous videos of this tutorial. Let's study a Stanford bunny that comes from a 3D scanner. Thanks to the purple color of the mesh and the surface icon in the structure tab, we immediately spot that this model is only a surface with zero volume, which is not suitable for 3D printing. I can use the thicken tool to directly thicken the mesh to the desired thickness. I use a cutaway view to make sure that the thicken tool works properly. To check that the thickening didn't create any problems in the mesh, I use the check mesh tool. The mesh is actually self-intersecting. I tried to solve this issue with the intersection tool, but when I check the mesh again, I see that some issues are remaining. This is an example of a 3D file that is not perfectly repaired by SpaceClaim. By uploading this file to Sculteo.com, I can use the very powerful online repairing tools to repair my object. After a first automatic repair that leaves some holes in the mesh, I can use other repairing methods. Here, the visible reconstruction method is very efficient and I get a printable model in the end. Let's study another Stanford bunny which has been well scanned this time. As usual, I check the mesh and I see that the mesh is self-intersecting. As in the first example, I use the intersection tool in the cleanup section to identify the intersecting areas. Then, I hit the green check sign to make SpaceClaim solve these problems. This time, the check mesh tool indicates that there is no remaining issue. I can use the tools in the Adjust section to smooth, reduce or regularize the mesh. As an example, here I reduce the number of triangle by 20% which will make a lighter file that will be faster to upload and easier to handle for a 3D printer. I'm not going to use a cutaway view. It helps me understand that my design is full of useless material that I can safely remove. The easiest way to do this is to upload my design to Sculteo.com and use the hollowing tools that are optimized for 3D printing. The model is automatically hollowed with an appropriate thickness and I can add holes where I want. The automatic repairing tools will also solve the eventual remaining issues after uploading. Finally, the solidity check and thickening tools will ensure that my design is solid enough for 3D printing. My design is ready to be sent to the printer. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you soon on scootier.com.